so that's about the transport network. And then for wireless network, uh, we also have this uh, architecture evolution. Uh, DRAM, CRAM, and cloud RAM. Uh, DRAM means distri uh, distributed RAM. RAM means radio access network. Okay. And CRAM means centralized uh, radio access network. And the cloud RAM means a CU and a DU separation. First, let's see what is DRAM. DRAM means distributed RAM. Okay. Distributed means that our baseband and the radio unit are both at the base station site. We have the BBU baseband processing unit and radio processing unit. The baseband is distributed, okay, distributed at the base station site. We call it DRAM. Baseband everywhere, every base station, okay, but distributed. Nowadays, it's this way. All the commercial network nowadays is using this way. And uh, CRAN means that the BBU are installed in the center, uh, center equipment room. So it is uh, convenient for the baseband coordination. Uh, a lot of BBUs installed together. They can share the resources. They can have the co uh, coordination uh, for, of the baseband resource. Uh, it's, that, it's good for the resource uh, sharing. Uh, but it needs more op optical fiber connections. Okay. The base station side, only there is a radio unit. So they need the uh, optical connection from the radio unit to our uh, baseband. So this is this one uh, is uh, good for this uh, baseband coordination, but it needs more optical resources. And in the future, the BBU baseband part can be separated into CU and the DU two parts. Here you can see for the DRAM and the CRAM, we have one BBU. We have one BBU, and in the cloud RAM, that this BBU are separated into CU and the DU, two parts. The CU is called the center unit. The DU uh, is called the distributed unit. So for the, uh, for the processing which need the low latency, real-time processing okay, will be in the DU and at the base station site. Okay. And for the Processing which are not real-time processing, uh, usually it's just some control plane processing. It will be deployed at the CU. So we can say that the DU is a simplified BBU. You can see this this uh, structure looks like 2G and 3G. Uh, in 2G and 3G, we have a base station, and then we have a BSE or RMC. Okay, so this is CU is just something like RNC and BSC. So you can see that in the future, our structure will return back to 2G or 3G time. About the CU deployment, uh, CU can be deployed uh, in, it's a cloudified, a cloudified. So it can be deployed at the center DC or aggregation layer. If the CU is deployed at the center DC, it means that it can manage more resources. It can manage more DU because it's a center. Okay. It can manage more DU, but the thing that the, the shortcoming is that the delay is longer because their distance is longer. Delay is long longer. Okay. The DU can also be deployed at the aggregation layer. In this case, it will be near to the DU. So the, late, the delay will be shorter because their distance is uh, shorter. The delay will be shorter. But uh, the shortcoming is that this CU can manage less number of this, this one. Because it's near the base station, okay? it can be connected with less number of base stations. And this one can manage around 100 times of the DU, and this one only can manage around 10 times of the DU. So this is about the CU uh, deployment.